I'm Dr. Julie Fisher, a medical oncologist here at the Levine Cancer Institute. Sometimes scans demonstrate abnormalities. We can't know for sure what those are without a biopsy. In that case, your doctor may refer you for a biopsy to be done with the guidance of the CT scan. My name is Richard Redmanley. I work with Charlotte Radiology and my specialty is body imaging. Percutaneous biopsy is a common procedure. We typically perform it in the hospital with image guidance. Typically we use either CT or ultrasound guidance and we use imaging guidance either to avoid certain structures to diminish our chance of complications but more importantly to get precise placement within whatever it is we're trying to biopsy. We'd like you to arrive approximately 90 minutes prior to your procedure. That way you can be seen by our nurses who will go over your medical history, start an IV, bring a list of medications, especially if you are taking blood thinners. After that, our imaging technologist will come in, talk with you, and bring you back to either the CT room or the ultrasound room where we'll do the procedure. When you uh, arrive into the imaging suite, whether it's CT or ultrasound, we'll take a series of uh, preliminary images so that we can determine the best manner in which to do the biopsy. At that point, we'll mark your skin, just with a magic marker, and then we'll clean your skin with antiseptic solution. We'll put a sterile drape over that area so we have a clean place to work. We'll give you some local anesthesia under the skin and I typically tell patients that's probably the only time you're a little bit uncomfortable. But soon after that, the skin and the surrounding tissue will be nice and numb and really shouldn't feel much of anything. And then at that point, we'll start the biopsy. The biopsy ought to take approximately two to three hours. And that includes pre-procedure prep time, and then probably 15 to 30 minutes of the actual biopsy time. Once we perform the biopsy and obtain tissue, the tissue is sent to pathologists who will then evaluate the material and send the results to your doctor. Thank you for choosing Charlotte Radiology and Levine Cancer Institute for your care.